South Lake police say a 19 year old driver is in custody after he hit several vehicles, then got out and started shooting. Good evening, I'm Steve Eager. It looks like you can see the, sh the bullets hitting the ground right behind that person running. That's amazing. Surveillance video from a nearby business shows people running for cover. No one was hit. South Lake police say an officer returned fire before eventually taking that suspect into custody. Fox Wars' Alex Boyer is in South Lake with what witnesses are saying. Alex. Yeah, hey, Steve, you know, and a witness described that scene as something out of a Wild West movie. And after you've seen that surveillance video for yourself, uh, it's really truly amazing that no one was hit by that gunfire. From Sky 4, you can see the scope of the crime scene in South Lake. On the ground, several vehicles involved in the wrong way crash sit idle on South Lake Boulevard between Carroll and Central Avenues, where the incident ended in a shootout between the wrong way driver and a South Lake police officer. One of my construction partners just came running inside. That shot's been fired outside. That's his construction worker closest to the jewelry store who had gone outside to see what happened. One of the victims screamed to him that the suspect had a gun. Listen again. According to South Lake Police, this all started around 9.30 a.m. when they got 911 calls saying someone in a gold van was driving the wrong way on West South Lake Boulevard. I saw this van coming straight towards me the wrong way down 1709 in my lane, and I was like, oh my gosh. And so I put on my blinker to get over, but he ended up getting over. Tiffany Perry said the driver, later identified as 19-year-old Sean Jordan of Colleyville, made a U-turn and started speeding down East South Lake Boulevard. That's when police say he struck several vehicles before crashing his van. He was not stopping at the lights. He was going straight through them. And then probably two minutes later, I heard ambulance and, you know, police and fire truck. As a South Lake police officer arrived on scene, Jordan allegedly pulled a rifle from the van and began firing at another driver and the officer. Investigators say that responding officer returned fire in defense of himself and the other driver. Miraculously, no one was hit by the gunfire. It was a very, like for a second, I was very shaken because you never know, you know, with the world we live in and just everything that's transpiring, be the bigger person, be the bigger person, bite your tongue and just be safe. I really just pray and be safe. And Jordan is charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. South Lake police say he could face additional charges. A motive remains unclear.